This is Stephanie Schübke from the German Heart Center in Munich. We are here at the ESC Congress in Paris where I presented the ISA REACT 5 trial, which is a comparison of Ticagrelor and Prazogel in acute coronary syndrome patients. We really aim to compare both drugs in a head to head trial because both drugs are the cornerstone treatment in ACS patients and both have received a class 1 recommendation. However, the relative merits of these drugs in the whole spectrum of acute coronary syndrome patients regarding one year clinical outcomes were unclear. We enrolled a total of 4,018 patients and assigned them to either a tacagulo based strategy or a prosegrade strategy. The trial was investigator initiated, randomized, multi-center open label and patients were enrolled in 23 centers, 21 in Germany and two in Italy. The primary endpoint was a composite endpoint of death, myocardial infarction or stroke at one year after randomization and the safety endpoint was bleeding, bark type 3 through 5. We hypothesized the Ticagrelor would be superior to Prazogrel. However, contrary to our expectation, we found that Prazogrel was superior to Ticagrelor for the primary endpoint of all-cause deaths, myocardial infarction and stroke at one year. And importantly, this increased efficacy did not occur at the expense of an increased bleeding risk. Bleeding with Prazogrel compared to Ticagrelor was not increased. The trial not only compared two drugs but also two strategies, that is pretreatment versus no pretreatment in non ST elevation acute coronary syndrome patients. The COAST trial taught us that pretreatment with Prazogrel does not provide benefit in terms of ischemic events but causes a significant increase in TB major bleeding. Therefore, pretreatment with Prazogrel is not recommended. We don't have these head-to-head -head comparison trials with Ticagrelor comparison, uh, comparing pretreatment with no pretreatment in non-ST elevation acute coronary syndromes. But based on the design and the results of the PLATO trial, guidelines recommend to use Ticagrelor if pretreatment is intended. So we use these recommended strategies in non-ST elevation acute coronary syndrome patients also in ISORICT 5, that is pretreatment with Ticagrelor versus no pretreatment with Prazogel. So in summary, the trial has shown that a Prazogel based strategy with no pretreatment in non-ST elevation acute coronary syndrome patients is superior to a Ticagrelor based strategy.